We're kicking off with the newly passed so-called Big Beautiful Bill that could reshape the future of NASA because legislative fireworks are also now a thing. $85 million would go towards the transport of a space vehicle to a NASA center. Now, in particular, the transfer of the space vehicle needs to follow a series of very specific requirements per the language of this bill. For example, it needs to be transferred to a center that's involved in the commercial crew program and must be placed in a public exhibition at an entity within the metropolitan area where such a center is located. Additionally, the space vehicle in question needs to be one that has already flown into space, has carried astronauts, and is selected with the concurrence of an entity designated by the administrator. Hmm, you know, all of this sounds really familiar to what Senators Ted Cruz and John Cornyn of Texas proposed back in April to move the space shuttle Discovery from the Smithsonian outside of D.C. to Houston, Texas. Now, the point of their proposal was that, at least in their view, Houston should have received one of the space shuttle orbiters after the end of the program, since it's home to the Johnson Space Center and Mission Control. Now, this has been a long debated topic over the years, and we're just going to go ahead and ignore the fact that they also think that Enterprise shouldn't even be in New York City at the Intrepid Museum. So yeah, those kind of very specific requirements in this bill kind of seem like a way to shoehorn that proposal from April into it and force NASA to move Discovery to Texas. 